TV. I'm your host, Nathan Martinez, and with my co-host is Gavin Cody. How are you, Gavin? I'm good, Nate. Uh, do you know what today's special is? I sure do, Nate. It's our Christmas special. In today's episode, we will have two men on the street asking important questions. We will look at a unified bowling and to finish it off, we'll play What's in the Box. So stick around. You're watching Cold Nation TV. South High School. I would like to welcome all the future Colts. of our black and white tradition. The South High Culture is waiting for you. Key Club is in charge of the cannon and shoots it off at football games. It is a fun way to get in your community service hours with all the community service projects, such as food drives for homeless shelters, helping out animal shelters, and visiting elementary schools. They meet at least once a week and have many leadership opportunities. It is a great way to make new friends and try some new things. If you're interested, you can talk to Mr. Gallardo in room 23 for more information. We're back to Cold Nation TV. To start things off, right, we have two new men on the street talking to our fellow Colts. Let's check it out. Hi, I'm Colby Wyatt. I'm Luke Den. And this is a very special episode of Men on the Street. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me, where's the North Pole? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Where, where's the North Pole? The North Pole. What is the best Christmas present you've ever gotten? A dog. I don't know. Yeah, my dog. That's pretty cool. Ryan, for candy, sing a Christmas carol. Deck the halls with bells of holly. La 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 Hey! <laughs> Excuse me sir, are you friends with Frosty the Snowman? Hey, excuse me, stop walking away. For a candy, <laughs> sing a Christmas song. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Excuse me, do you know the Muffin Man? Yeah. Excuse me, do you believe in Santa Claus? Yes. Excuse me, sir, sir. Do you know who I am? <laughs> Alright, excuse me. For a candy, what is my favorite color? Your favorite color? Yeah. Green. Wrong. Let's go. Excuse me, sir. Do you believe in Santa Claus? Uh, yeah. Okay. yeah here you go. Good answer. No. For a candy, no, do your best no. Santa impression. Best yeah, Santa. Right. For a candy. <laughs> Thank you to all the Cold Nation students who participated in our questions. Just a few weeks ago, the Unified Bowling Team won their first state championship. This was the second year that they got to compete for the first state championship. CNTV's very own Ryan had a chance to talk with some of the players and their coach. Let's check it out. This is South's bowling team, the team's second year of playing. They became an official high school sport in 2020. Coach Delgado has been coaching for two years now and has already brought home a state title. Now let's hear what some of his players have to say. Hi, I'm Ryan, and we're here with two of the state championship bowlers for South High. Uh, hi, guys. Good to have you here. Um, 
I'm, get, I'm gonna ask you guys a few questions if you don't mind. Uh, I'm gonna start with Brandon. Uh, how was winning the state championship game uh, for being two years into uh, sort of the bowling team uh, official season? That's awesome though. We, we bowl for the championship. Me, Cheyenne, bowls. And we land the bowls in. I make it, make it spares and we score, score 415. Thank you, Brandon. I'm gonna go to Charles. <laughs> Um, what would you say to anyone that wants to join the bowling team next year? Honestly, if they wanted to join the bowling team, I'm pretty sure they will try their best and work hard on their skills that they have and learning about it and probably do their best. Mm -hmm. Let's see what their average scores were. What would you say your average score was uh, when you were bowling? It's going like, like, like I got practice. I bowled like by four, two, 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 two. two. Wow, that's a that's a high score. Now let's ask Coach Delgado what it means to be a unified bowling team. Hello, we're here with uh, Coach Delgado and Lorenzo from the unified bowling team here at South High. Uh, I'm going to start with Coach. Uh, Coach, what makes unified bowling unified? Uh, unified bowling is uh, comprised of special needs students and general education students on the same team, uh, as well as uh, unified is co-ed, so there's boys and girls. So it's just a combined effort uh, um, in competition. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Coach Lorenzo. We're going to go to you. Lorenzo, we understand that you're a senior. How does it feel to be the big man on campus and bring a state title home for us? It's an awesome feeling, especially like how you said, being a senior, knowing it's your final year. You had your final chance to do it, and we pulled through with the win. It's a great feeling knowing I'm going off to the sunset with the championship. Mm -hmm. I'm sure. Thank you guys so much for your time. I'm Ryan Lane, and you're watching Colt Nation TV. Congratulations and thank you again to the Bullet team for bringing home the win. When we get back, we'll play What's in the Box and visit once more with the man. TV. Hi, my name is Tanish Chavez and I'm the student body president here at South High. And five reasons to join student council is because we get to put on the spirit days here at South High. We get to pick the parade theme and the dance theme. You can support your community and your school. We help decorate the school for holidays and events and there are many leadership opportunities. If you're interested in joining Student Council, go see Ms. Olsen in room three for more information. Key Club is in charge of the cannon and shoots it off at football games. It is a fun way to get in your community service hours with all the community service projects, such as food drives for homeless shelters, helping out animal shelters, and visiting elementary schools. They meet at least once a week and have many leadership opportunities. It is a great way to make new friends and try some new things. If you're interested, you can talk to Mr. Gallardo in room 23 for more information. And welcome back to CNTV. Ready? One. And welcome back, back to CNTV. For those who are tuning in, that's our, that stands for Colt Nation TV. And this is our Christmas special. We would like to give a big shout out to all the people who made this possible. Without our CNTV student run crew, this would not be possible. To spread a little Christmas cheer, the CNTV crew and our very special guest, Coach Goddard, got together to play a very special game of What's in the Box. Now, without further ado, What's in the Box? Hi, I'm Xavier and I'm here with Alyssa and today we're with Colt Nation TV to do What's in the Box. What does it feel like? I don't know. It feels like food. It's like food. sticky. Ew. <laughs> I think I know what it is. I think you know what it is? Yeah. Let's see. Kind of feels like up dog. <laughs> What's up dog? Nothing, what's up with you? Nothing much. What do you think is in the box, Sarah? Are we going? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I don't know what that is. Put your hand in there. Is that a sponge? 
All right, coach, let's see what's in the box, let's shall we? Let's find out. Go All ahead. right, thank You're you. Up first. Let's do it. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Feels like candy, but I don't. It might be like a, a marshmallow or something. Like soft. <laughs> All right, what do you think it is? Um, is it like a mini Christmas tree? That's what I think it is, a mini Christmas tree. Yeah. I don't know, it just, it seems hard. <laughs> like, it seems like... Hard to speak. No, bro, this is, this is hard. It's like an ornament. Yeah, it's an ornament. Huh. How come it feels like snoo? Snoo, ooh. What's new with you, coach? Nothing. Nothing. I think it's like a nutcracker. I think it's Santa, I think. A Santa? <laughs> yeah, like his face. There's two yeah. different things in here. <laughs> uh, my guess is a uh, marshmallow with like sugar on it. What's your I guess? I like um, one of those like cute bunny things, I think. You're probably right. All right, let's see what it is. I mean, you were pretty close. I was gonna say strand of lights. That's my guess. Strand of lights. Let's go. Strand of lights. Let's go, baby. Good job. Thanks, coach. Oh. The hell are these? Christmas trees? <laughs> are we done? That was great. A special shout out to CNTV's crew for putting this together. Now let's visit once more time this year with our very own man on the street. Christmas, yes or no? Yes. Why is that? Because it's Christmas. Great answer. Excuse me. Uh, for a candy, sing a Christmas song. Uh, no. For a candy, sing a Christmas song. It's for a candy. No. Man, everyone believes in Santa Claus. It's amazing. Yep. Okay. The school spirit, you know what I mean? Yep. Best Santa impression. Oh, um, ho, ho, ho. Excuse me, uh, what's your favorite Christmas movie? The Grinch. Good answer. <laughs> what's your favorite Christmas movie? Uh, The Grinch. All right. Uh, one or two? Two. Good answer. Give her a candy. <laughs> What do you think about that question? Here we go. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. We have a question. We have a question. What is your favorite Christmas movie? Okay, what is your favorite Christmas movie? Probably The Elf. Is Die Hard a Christmas movie? No, I would not say so. Okay, then what is your favorite Christmas movie? It's a Wonderful Life. It's an old movie. Excuse me, uh, did you get your mom a Christmas present? No. Why not? It's Maybe only not. December 8th. Thank you, to, thank you, Kobe and Luke, for roaming the halls this holiday season. Keep an eye out for future episodes available on the South High School Facebook page as well as on YouTube. Just look for Colt Nation TV. Remember, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, and Happy New Year, and see y'all next time on Cold Nation TV. You are watching Cult Nation TV.